Good morning, precious people of God. Mark 3 and 29. But anyone who blasphemes the Holy Spirit will never be forgiven. There is a sin with eternal consequences. The thought that I want to share with you this morning is honor God's Spirit. The Holy Spirit is none other than God's Spirit. Today's word is a warning, yet an encouraging word. We are to honor the Spirit of God. Because the Word of God itself says when you dishonor serious consequences. I want you to love and depend upon the Holy Spirit. He is gentle. He is kind. He wants to assist you. He is the one called alongside you. He is your advocate. He is your comforter. He is all that you need today when you go to work, when you go to college, when you go wherever you go today. Make sure the Holy Spirit comes with you. Because when the Holy Spirit is with you, you will move and find your being in the power of His resurrection. This morning, do not dishonor the Holy Spirit by word, deed. How do you dishonor the Holy Spirit? You don't give Him credit. Even worse, you attribute His manifestation as demonic. Don't do that. The Holy Spirit is real. He's a real person. And you can sense His presence tangibly every minute of your life. Love Him. Honor Him today. Father, we thank You for Your precious Spirit. We thank You for the Holy Spirit that gives us that strength and ability and mobility that we desperately need in life. I pray, Holy Ghost, that you will minister to us. You would grant your people that wisdom to honor the Spirit of God so that they would operate in the empowerment of the Holy Ghost, so that they will be successful, they will be efficient, and no power would cause them to be destroyed because they will operate in the might of the Holy Ghost. We thank you and we praise you and we ensure we go with the Holy Ghost today in all of our activities. In Jesus' name, Amen.